Hi everyone, my name's Claire and I'm making videos on being pregnant during Covid and becoming a new mum for the first time. This video is going to be about shopping and it's going to be about what I've ordered so far, what's arrived and bits and bobs that our friends and family have kindly gifted us up to now. As I said in the last video, we do not know the sex of the baby. We're not going to find out. It's going to be a happy surprise at the time. The previous video is on our scans that we had and how what the process was for them during this COVID pandemic and how that affected me and my partner um, seeing our baby for the first time. I also showed you pictures of the scans, the first one at 12 weeks and the second one at 20 weeks. Um, unfortunately in Scotland you only get two scans on the NHS uh, so that is us done. We won't see the baby now until it's born. I'm currently 24 weeks so we have already ordered or bought the big items. So this is our first baby. The big items were the travel system which includes the the pram, the car seat, the buggy, the carry cot. Um, so that's been ordered and that has actually arrived excitingly. Um, I will show you that in detail in the next video and I'll go through why we picked it and um, you know the style of it etc. The other big thing that we needed to get because obviously we're starting from scratch was the cot, the, the bedroom furniture that we're going to have in the nursery. Now this was a really really difficult thing to order because I struggle ordering things online without seeing the quality of them and during this lockdown we've been unable to go out to the shops to actually have a look and see the quality and see how things actually look size wise. So that was a real struggle for me. As things started to open back up we were really fortunate that we have a, a large nursery shop in Glasgow, it's called the Pram Centre and it is massive they've got loads of displays out and you can you can easily look at all the bedroom furniture they have there for nurseries so when that opened back up it was by appointment only we uh, made an appointment online turned up um they were only allowing i think it was maybe 10 people in the shop at one time um you had to wear a mask hand sanitizer everything was, uh, you had um, 45 minute slots and everything was sanitised between people coming in and people leaving for the, you know, the, the next rotation of people. So that was really lovely, going to see all the, the nurseries set up. Um, some of the nurseries we'd seen online, we went to, when we actually saw them in real life, they were quite flimsy or the, the cots were really, really small. Um, we want this to last our child, um, we, you know, you can get ones that change into a cot bed, which is what we have ordered. So we wanted to be slightly larger. The room that we're using for the nursery is quite a large room. Um, I will show you it. It's painted now and um, we are just waiting for the carpet to go down. So once that's down, I'll take you through and I'll go through what we plan, where we plan to put the furniture and um, what else we plan to do with the room. So at the moment, it is a work in progress. So a silver lining to this COVID lockdown situation is that some of our family and friends that uh, can knit have had some more time on their hands and because we're having a winter baby, they have really, really kindly knitted us some pieces which I'm gonna show you. Um, there's still a few bits um, that people have said that they're, they're working on just now. So a couple of shawls, um, and I think a couple more cardigans but I'll show you what we have so far because it's so adorable. So the first things I'm going to show you is this uh, are these um, two cardigans. Now these are super white obviously we don't know what we're having so um, most people have just gone with white and these have got such cute detailing uh, down the front and the little buttons and these are for you know kind of first size baby so adorable and this one's pretty similar but it's got a different pattern at the front it's kind of cable knit at the front and um, but the same idea just a little the little buttons at the front and the little arms it's so cute so they were kindly gifted to us also a uh, 
um, with the knitted knitted items, um, got these little booties. Now these are just off white. They're kind of slightly cream, which is neutral. It can be used for a boy or a girl, and they have little buttons across them. Now these will look. These are, are quite big, but in the beginning, I think over over a kind of onesie. Um, these will keep their little feet really cute and really warm. Um, over winter, you know. Oh, so cute. Very, very adorable. So I cannot wait um, till our baby can, can try these on and get wrapped up all nice and warm in winter time. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you is some baby grows that we've been gifted um, and one that I got my partner um, because he is extremely excited about coming a daddy. Um, so this is from H&M and I saw it, it was actually in the H&M sale, but it's, uh, um, I think it's newborn, I'm guessing from the size of it. Um, yeah, newborn, or one, one month it says. So it says, I love daddy, and it has got some little shorts and also a little hat that says, I love dad. Now that is just gonna be the cutest thing ever. <laughs> so that's what I got him. Um, also, because our little baby is going to be born in 2020, we have this. I think this will be a really, really cute first size because I think from what I've heard, babies go through a lot of clothes at the beginning. They need changed a lot. And the next few things are um, from my mum, so because we don't know what we're having, she went quite neutral with the colours, so we've got this with the little lines on them. My partner absolutely loves the Lion King, so he, you'll see a theme because um, everybody knows he loves the Lion King. This one, I think these are all from Tesco, yeah, I think they're Tesco. This one's Love Our Planet with a little um, shorty. These are little shorty ones. This one's got tigers on it. Very adorable. This one is a onesie. So this one's quite good. It's got the feet and it's got the fold over mitts for its little fingers so it doesn't scratch itself. And this one's more lines on it. Very cute. This is also a Tesco. So that's beautiful. We also have received from my partner's mother, my mother-in-law, some Simba socks. Now these are quite big. Um, I mean, it says first size, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure how big its feet are gonna be. But these ones are all, so they've got the Simba one. They've got some just plain stripy ones. Then they have Timon and Pumbaa. Uh, some more stripy ones. And then they've got Simba. So cute, so cute. We, We have also received a baby's first toy, which is exciting because it's something I didn't really think about. I obviously thought about clothes and the, the necessities that you need to buy, but I didn't actually think about toys, obviously, to stimulate. So we received this. Now, this is so cute. It is colourful. It is makes noise. It's got mirrors. It's got a little plastic hooks. It's also got a hook at the top, which I'm guessing can be hooked onto the pram. It can be hooked onto anywhere you'd like it, on the, the bouncy chair or whatever. But extremely, extremely cute. Very colorful, very, very baby appropriate. So I think that is a very adorable first toy that we've received. It also doesn't play music, which is very, very nice. So that is my video on what we've got so far for the baby in terms of being gifted items, what we've purchased ourselves and what we have on order to arrive for the baby. So next video, I'm going to show you the pram and the travel system in general, and I'll go through why we picked it, what we were looking for in a pram and price point um, and everything, everything to do with the, the travel system. 
So I hope you enjoyed this video. I cannot wait to continue sharing this journey with you. It's getting closer. I'm 24 weeks pregnant. So I am, is that five and a half months roughly? It is getting exciting. It's getting closer and the time is flying in. So please join me for this journey and I will keep you updated. Thank you. Bye.